Good evening, everyone. I'm Don Poyer, and with me is Bob Elliott. And welcome to America West Arena for this exhibition game. If I could watch only one game this week, I think this would be the one. Both of these teams have some great competitors on their roster, so look for some great individual efforts throughout the game. The 60s All-Stars couldn't stop the deep jumper. And now they're paying with it. Takes the shot. Yes. Oscar Robertson, the assist to number 44, Jerry West. Gugliotta with a little crossover. He comes up empty. Chamberlain gets the rebound. To Big O. Finger roll. He tickles the twine with another step. Uh, this field goal percentage is off the chart. Marion, crossover on his defender. That's domination, baby! Stop that! West will bring it up court. He sets it up on the right side. He bumps it. Goes up. Oh, my goodness! 4-3. Starbury. One minute to go. Turns, coming up the court, down on the block. This is on. Marius is called for the defensive foul. <laughs> Baylor is a sharpshooter from the strike. Elgin Baylor. Sinks it. Hardaway will bring it up court. Makes his jumper. No. Takalidis takes the offensive rebound. Gugliotta with a quick crossover. Russell with a defensive foul. Bill Russell, first foul in the final two minutes. Marion spin. And he is feeling it. The assistant, number 25. Marbury is called for the defensive foul. Now is the time when teams either come together or break apart. I'd say these guys usually come together in a crunch, but players like that are putting them to the test. The 60s All-Stars are ahead by five. Marbury is usually amongst the league leaders in assists. Just when defenders think they have him contained, he can dish off for an easy two. To tackle Hardaway from downtown. Chamberlain grabs the rebound. They're running and gunning. Up for the lay-in. The Suns give up another. Down in situations like that, don't start drawing at the ref. Get yourself back on me. Sakalitas with the crossover. Shot blocked by the Big Dipper. To Takalitas. For three. Oh, yes. Yeah. For three. Last one for three. At the end of the first, the 60s All Stars are up 14 to 10. Bob, how would you say play has gone so far? Well, I think the first quarter played out pretty much the way we expected it. I'd like to see one of these teams start shaking things up out there. Baylor puts it up. Marion takes the board. Marbury shakes his defender with a nice little crossover. The assistant, Penny Hart. Get back! West will bring it up court. Short pass to Russell. Yes! The 60s All-Stars are up by four. Oscar Robertson. Marbury takes his defender, lays it in. Robertson feels they have an advantage down low, and they're going to try and exploit it. Now we're going to need to send a little more energy to these guys. Number one, Oscar Robertson. He's taking his game above the rim. That gives him six points. The assistant, number three, Stephon Marbury. I think we're seeing a call for some boats play here. 
You want to work the ball inside and see how the defense One reacts. To go in the Marbury second. with a quick crossover. Robertson with a defensive foul. foul. To number one, Oscar Robertson. Marion, good fake. Beanie has been getting good position, but just can't come up with a button. West sets it up on the left side. Robertson is trying to get the ball into the post area. If they can get points in the paint, it may open up the outside shot. To Gugliata. With a little crossover. Yes! They've had a hard time defending against those quick passes. West will bring it up court. They should try to make the most of this. Up fake from three-point range. Got it. He's got his game face on for this one. I can't remember the last time he missed. Hardaway sets up the offense. All-Stars lead the Suns 21 to 18. Uh, NBA Live, yeah. 2003. Hot Carl MC, yo. EA Sports, it's like wow. Yeah. We've seen this team play their kind of game so far. The other team has been content to just let them set the tempo of the game. But look for that to change in the second half. Unloads a three. Got it. Mr. Clutch is coming up big for them tonight. This man is a serious athlete. Spread their offense. It gives him the room he needs to operate. Really makes a tough draw on the defender. Takalitas takes the board. Brown with a finger roll. Brown. Baylor is trying to run some plays for the big men to get some production in the paint. Stolen. You gotta keep your eyes open out there. Even if it's a bad pass, you just need to be aware of it and make a play for the ball. West sets it up. He's been robbed. Phoenix playing the transition game. Takes the shot. Nails the jam. He leads the team with 10 points. One minute for me. For three. Robertson. No good. Outlaw takes the rebound. Their energy has definitely dropped a couple of notches. Seems to me they're looking to generate some points in the paint. Chamberlain puts up the shot. The Suns will let that one go. Right now they need to concentrate on getting the points back. Hardaway sets it up on the right side. Suns and the 60s All-Stars are tied at 26. With one quarter to play, we have a tie. But when you look at the scoreboard, it doesn't tell you much about which team has momentum coming into this quarter. A lot of coaches will complain that the players are not getting enough trips to the line. Now when they get them, they'd better make the most of them. He hits it! West is looking to go down low and get some points in the paint. Oh, yes! 
Browns has yeah. to get there quicker to prevent the other team from getting those easy scores. Chamberlain is called for the defensive foul. The coach could not have been happy about that last call. Oh, yeah, he wasn't, that's for sure. But he knows that getting into it with the official is not going to help things. No good. Baylor picks it out of the air. To Robertson. Big O wants to try and work it into the post here. Shoots a three-pointer. He misses it. Dakalitas boards it. Dishes off to Brown. The Hardaway. He puts up the jumper. He drains it. The 60s All-Stars had to let him shoot that time. And that's something they wanted to happen. Baylor is trying to get the ball into the post area. They can get points in the paint. It may open up the outside shot. The Brown. One minute to go in the fourth quarter. The Hardaway with a quick crossover. Robertson picks up the foul. Oscar Robertson. That's his second This player personal. will be near the Shooting top of the free throw standings for the season. It would be nice to see him take top honors in that category. I'd say he deserves it. Hardaway makes them both. Bob, any thoughts as we head into OT? You know, just one of those weird statistical things. Overwhelmingly, the team that scores first in overtime usually wins. Really? Hey, he tears it down. Domination is in full effect. The assist to West, good thing. Fires it. He drains it. When it comes to shooting, this man is unstoppable. With the layup, the 60s All-Stars didn't react to the drive. When a player is attacking the basket like that guy, he is everybody's defensive side. One minute to block. Penny isn't going to get lit up by a shot like that. Marion buys the shot play. Block! For three! Robertson can't find the hole. Takalitas grabs it to Brown with the layup. Need to get back in transition when you're on the pace. West sets it up on the left side. Looks at a three. That's what I call a power jam. Hardaway sets 
Sets it up on the right side. To Hardaway. To Marion. With a nice shot fake. Baylor with the interception. West sets up the offense. Robertson feels they have an advantage down low. They're going to try and exploit it. From way downtown. The ninth final score is side 42. The 60s All-Stars 40. Here is the player of the game. Joe Crazy. Uh, please, please, leave. B R A N. 